show my live video please my live video feed that's right you get singing if you hear earlier what No, thank you. Oh, my phone's upside down. Oh, I see. I clicked the camera button by mistake. Hi. Uh, wow, look at that weird blank spot on the uh, scheduler there. Wow, look at that. What an, uh, what an interesting uh, thing that is. Um, hi. Um, so we're looking at the Unreal Engine. Oh, I found it actually. Unreal Engine has taken has been taken out as a as a category, but it is it's now in as a tag. So you can just you can just tag your stuff now instead of categorizing it, which I feel is is a step back, maybe a step in the wrong di direction. I pressed the wrong button. Uh, so anyway, I was on the Unreal Engine for Discord. Or the Unreal Engine Discord, I guess, not specifically about Unreal Engine Four, but I guess they deal with the most, the most recent kind of branch. Uh, and uh, I asked about having uh, physics separated from the the visual representation, as in, you know, having a blueprint, which was a uh, kind of like a scene. Can I just adjust my pop filter, please? I hate this. It's like, can you? You're meant to be a flexible goose. I'll do, I guess. It's, it's too long. I've got it wrapped around the entire mic. Hi. Uh, anyway, uh, a very helpful guy or girl person, very helpful person on the Unreal Engine Discord said that I should look at the content examples because it contains a whole bunch of real basic ass gamer style prefabs that you probably should one, know how to do, and two, just be able to steal really for your, for your stuff. Welcome to the Math Noise stream. I see we've got uh, volumetric fog be trending. That's pretty sick. Uh, anyway, I did download the content examples off str off stream off off uh, the content examples. Great project. Um, name content examples. Explore. Fun spoiler. Uh, I don't want to. Don't want to do it in. I do not want to do it in C. Fuck's sake. Uh, I want to do it in G. <sighs> Unreal projects. Yeah. That's fine. Uh, create. Oh, here we go. <coughs> so was a phrase license grant allowed from distribution of sub license. It doesn't include any engine code or paid content distributed in uncooked source format. Each case, including as a modified by you, the license and does not require any license technology, including as modified by you under the license to run unrestricted products for clarity the foregoing does not constitute a license under patents copyrights trademarks trade secrets or intellectual property rights whether by implication s topple or otherwise good you may distribute only you may only distribute the license technology as follow distribution to end users boom you can send them game The product may not contain any paid content distributed in uncooked source format or any engine tools. So, I'm pretty sure I've read this all before. Quote unquote read. Okay, I'm the only. Let me just. Hello. Royalties based on gross revenue from the end users, regardless of whether you sell your product to the end users directly, self published by the App Store or any similar store, work with the publisher. Following a simplified example, it's the application of royalty to gross sales. Your product earns ten dollars on App Store. Apple may pay you seven dollar, having deducted thirty percent of the distribution fee, but your epic royalty would still be five percent of ten dollars fifty cent. 
Hey, that's not even a lot. Hey, fuck you, Apple. <laughs> Taking 30%. Whew. I'll set up my own fucking video game store. Oh, there's a lot of bold text here. Virus free. Oh, God. Oh, it's limitation of liability. Okay. If someone sends you a virus made in Unreal, that's not Unreal's business. Yeah, whatever. Ah, sorry about that. That was boring. That was so boring, in fact. Do you mean you didn't download already? Oh, you mother. You mother. Is, um. Is everyone uh, enjoying the stream? Good. I guess we've got a, a few moments to. Uh... Jesus, three point five gigabytes. I could have. I could have sworn. I could have sworn I did this already. Oh, whatever. So let's check out auto settings. I just want to check it out. I don't want to. I want to do anything. You see, there's a downloads there. It's still going. It's still going. Oh, it's not downloading. It's installing. Oh, it is downloading. Fuck off. Auto settings, game options, and input binding toolkit is a comprehensive and highly configurable game options and input binding toolkit that supports a range of functionality that is standard on PC and console games. Look at how clean that looks. <clears throat> So uh yeah we got we got a couple of we got a couple of moments to to chill out and talk if you want to chill out and talk I will in fact uh launch the bubble man so we can fly around maybe we can play some bubble man while we wait you know I'll play with a pad as well because um you don't get full range of uh <laughs> You can get full range of movement on the keyboard. I don't know why it keeps booting Steam VR. We're not making a VR game, and we're not playing Steam VR. Thank you. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, basically what we're gonna do today is we uh, we uh, start. Steam isn't even open. All right. So I think, uh, hello? Hello? <laughs> you gotta select the window before you can actually play. Uh, ah, right, it's square to shoot. Not X or A or whatever. Oh. Come on, my boys. Go on, babies. I'm gonna get you back. I'm gonna get you home. So I was thinking about editing the uh, the uh, the movement of these of not the babies, but the ghosts. The babies are potentially fine right now. We're going for a high score, guys. Don't. Can't even pause the game. Does the game pause when I when I die?
Whoa. Those babies have been uh, have been trapped by ghosts. Oh, free them! Yes, free the babies. Oh, oh wow! Baby got instant zapped. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, game over. Let's see how far we've uh, we've downloaded. I'm sure you can see in the. Where's my mouse? Oh, we haven't. <laughs> Looks like it's about fifty percent done. Mm. Oh, we have uh, we have some drop frames on the network. Excuse me. Hold on a sec. <laughs> so, uh, are we good now? No, we're still dropping frames for some reason. I guess it's because we're downloading. Quote unquote, guess. I mean, we've got three green lights. There shouldn't be anything wrong with the uh, the internet. It seems to be fine. I get the red light now. Oh, thank. I say it seems to be fine, and I get the red light. Thank you. The the kilobits up is, you know, six to eight K. Uh, my drop frames network hasn't changed that much. You tell me. You tell me, buddy. I'm not a I'm not a network engineer. It's always a shock though to look over and see it uh rectangular, as it were. See, it goes orange, and then it goes red instantly afterwards. Someone... I don't wanna... I'm not on the internet. Yeah. Well, I am, but not that internet. Not the Wi-Fi. I'm on the 4G. For anyone worrying about this uh, being a garbled mess on the VODs, don't worry. The VODs are local recordings, as I've said many times before. And uh, therefore, if you wanted to watch this and it's it's been a bit choppy, just, you know, wait until about Wednesday. It should be up on YouTube. We are almost completely downloaded, though. 2.8 out of 3.5 gigabingos. Uh, we're still dropping frames. So that's um, there's a cable just in front of one of that... Let me just move that. Make sure I'm plugged in properly. Yeah. That was uh, me destroying my microphone. Yeah, it so shouldn't be. It shouldn't be too bad. But such is the way of things. I'm pretty sure we got. Why are you rolling over? It's like. Oh, there's a cable. Oh, Jesus. It's my USB-C cable for, for VR. <laughs> Is there somewhere we can put this boy so he doesn't get in the way? Oh, perfect. 
throw a little loopy doop on him. You get behind. Yes. I'm getting towards the time in the year where multiple dice sojis are required. And maybe a a new set of shelves. Love a new set of shelves, mate. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Uh, and to fund my set of shelves, you should follow me uh, and watch my videos. Wink, wink, hint, hint. Mm, the kilobits just hit the 4K mark. Wow. Oh, really? There's nothing going on. There's Epic, there's OBS, Stream Deck, Pens Outlet, wow. That's not going to be doing anything, is it? Oh yeah, I've got like 32 gigs of memory. Wow. Totally forgot about that. But anyway. Um, ah, yeah. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. Look, see? It was the download that was uh, affecting. So, professional tip. Professional streams. Don't download things. Not on stream. Uh, BPBM Kuini. Bone. Um, I think we need this. I don't think we need this. I don't think we need this. We'll just we'll have that for now, and then. I have no tasks, thank you. Uh, content examples explode. So I've had some feedback on the uh, on the old uh, dem on the old demo, the uh, the week ten snapshot, as it were. Uh, have I got my controller plugged in? I can just float around this. Opening maps levels to see the available selection of maps. Either choose file option, open level, content browser, bottom. What is this? It's like fully smooth. It's not fully smooth. That's that's rendered. Okay. Demo stands. Play or simulate stands. Okay. Interactive stands. Okay. Okay, documentation X is cool. So this is the Unreal Engine 4 content examples. Um, map, and then we want physics, blueprint, I don't think this is the one actually. Examples of various physics properties. What we got? Object simulating physics simulator play. Skeletal mesh rigid body simulating physics. Radio force impulse. Okay. Thruster. Okay. Physics constraints. Okay. Physics constraints. Angular motors. Oh. Okay. Physics constraints, linear motors, okay. Breakable. Play mode only. Um, I don't think this is the one. Um, I guess we just. Uh, there's, there's no shoot button. Oh. Oh, yeah, alright, okay. We can grab, grab things with the mouse button.
What's that in a controller? Eh? Mouse button not bound. <laughs> okay. Beautiful. Skeletal meshes need a physical asset. Yep. Okay. Radial force impulse. Thruster. Blocking volumes are just to restrict movement of the thruster. Cool. He's going wild, isn't he? Is this physics constraints? Okay. Angular motors. Constraints will by default not move by themselves, but an angular motor can be used to do so. Oh, we can add impulse with a right click. Oh, okay. All right, so they they're a bouncy. Okay. Anyway, that's not what we were looking for. We were looking for, I think, something beginning with blueprints. Project names must not be longer than 20 characters. It said 24 when I made the project, you bastard. <sighs> Parallax occlusion. Blueprints advanced, maybe? Maybe. Randomly scattered meshes there, whatever. Automatic wall, okay. Automatic rate, okay. Customizable spotlight. Okay. Oh, new room. Uh ah okay whatever button trigger uh. oh uh. okay that's not what we're looking for it's Mac example of using a parent child blueprints for access to benefit from showing the same base script these collectible pick up Blueprints are derived from the same parent, but each contains additional script following different results when collected by the player. Restore some health. You got a cupcake. Collected a coin. Okay. Construction script. Event graph. Okay. Physical animation. Oh, 
Okay, no. Okay. Okay. Ah! Oh, that's, that's the end. Ah. Oh. Uh. Prince overview, maybe. Hello world. Uh. Ah. Type of flow control knows modify movement, color, and effect. Let's have a look at this. Okay, add relative rotation. There you go. Boom. That's all we need to do. Event tick. Uh... I don't really want an event tick, do I? Is this flow control enumeration set relative location? That's time to sign. Oh, that's an up and down oscillation. Okay. Don't need an up and down oscillation. Uh, okay. Let's try that. Uh, event tick. Add rotate. Add, add, add local rotation coin. He's gone. So, um, kind of. Uh, 
it's gonna it's gonna throw a hissy fit. It's gonna say, uh, no, okay, that doesn't work. Got to simulate physics. Hit box. Simulate physics. Uh, collision. This will be like well, static, well dynamic. It's going to be indestructible. Okay. Ah, uh, do you know what it is? Uh, this boy. Let me just not have that for a while, maybe. Uh. Oh, do you know what? Um, we need that actually. We need that. I don't get this. I don't get, I don't get this. What's going on here? Add relative rotation. Oops. Did I have a uh, relative rotation? Know, maybe. Can I just bind this to that? Thank you. Uh, local rotation. Wah, wah. Good, good, 205, no, 2.5, hate you, fuck you, fuck you, goddamn text box, I'll show you. Cool. Uh, stop. This probably more likely want to be this, and we can probably drop a zero off this. Okay. Uh, coin. Simulate physics. No. What's wrong with you? Coin. Coin. For God's sake. Simulate physics. Okay. Mode. Lock rotation. Z. Good. Uh, ignore radial impulse. Ignore radial force. Collision. Bound to a fucking hitbox. Stop falling through my level. Stop it. You <laughs> piss me off.
that weird stop. Uh, how much does the hitbox weigh? Whoa! This is fun. This is, uh, am I losing frames? I'm not losing frames. What's going on with uh, OBS? It's slowing down. Hello, OBS. Hello. It's because you're in the background doesn't mean you're doing this stupid background rendering thing now. You're actually slowing down or you're just, you're just pretending you're slow. I hate this. Recently, Windows Explorer has been real thick. Not gonna lie, it's pissed me off. I'm gonna move to Linux. A Linux. Uh. Okay, so it doesn't have everything that I needed to do the thing with. Whoa. Did not want to make that the root scene.
Excellent. And now we just get a reference to the other hitbox. Let's put that on the target. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Play. 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 Okay, we've done something. We've done something wrong here. Simulation generates hits and events. Should hit events fire when this collides during physics simulation? No. No. Custom. Physics only. No query collision. Physics body. Yeah? What the heck? Coin. Uh, oh, well, Apple. And no physics. Okay. Um, okay, well, it's, it's a step in the right direction. Is that? Where is that? That is far too close to the camera. Oh, did it land on top of the hitbox? Did that, is that inside the baby? Baby move, baby move, please, baby move. Yeah, there it is. Uh, so it needs a lot less uh, of this. A lot less, I said, and a lot more of this. Uh. Uh. Stupid fucking controller. Uh, no, I want a float. I just want a float. <laughs> I just want um In fact, you know what? Uh, let's just uh, ah, oh, this shouldn't be very. It should it should be uh. Horizontal velocity range max and uh, 
of a vertical velocity range max. Good slam. Uh, 250 maybe? That doesn't need to be old, that needs to be impulse. Hello. Can you type? Please, for once, just do what I want you to do. And screen. Uh, does this mean we can have a rotator component instead of spin? Uh, who knows? Even 500 is a lot, isn't it? Oh, that's insane. Three fifty. Whoop. Oh wow. Okay, that's uh, looking all right, I don't know. I think we can... It's working at least. Oh, we can, well, we can still kick it. Ah, poopy. Um, well, that's a no. BM coin, other hitbox. What dynamic? Huh. The other one is just overlap all. Maybe if that was overlap instead. To show all the flaws of world static. Then we can have to be in that far corner, wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah that's better. Apparently the players are world dynamic, so. Yeah, we're making we're making baby steps here, man. We're making baby steps. Um Whoa. Bro, look how fucking dynamic it is when it's gold. Dude, just, can you see that? That's so cool. Still looks a bit funky, but... Can we, can we launch this full screen? Yeah, me. Yeah, can we launch it full screen? Let's save everything. Save everything and build the lighting.
Bruh, are you, uh, are you witnessing how cool that coin is? It's rendered, it's rendered better when it's full screen, definitely. So this, uh, oh, I'm getting a bit of lag. Oh, that's, that's some, some intense stuff we got going on here. Have I enabled ray tracing? Whoops. I see some, um... Well, there's definitely some more complex lighting going on. Well, buddy. So the idea is that these are gonna spill out of the, uh, out of the ghosts. Well, these babies, of course, we, we're here to capture the babies. I mean rescue, not capture. <laughs> For anyone wondering, I think it's fine that the babies maybe are getting caught by the ghosts when I'm not carrying them. I think that's fine. Because uh, there's something weird going on with my projectile, isn't there? I think we might have to uh, change the projectile sometime soon. It's, it's just, it's not ideal, is it? That is running a full program in it. Steam VR, I don't know, I don't know why you're doing that either. Save. Uh, other hitbox. Let me just let me just check a couple of things before we uh, before we stop this. So this is physics only, this has no physics, this has no collision in fact, physics only. My hitbox is query only. Uh, world dynamic, sure. Overlap all. Overlap all. Uh, simulate generates head events. Ah, no. No. Yes, there we go. So uh, we have the the hitbox, which is hidden in game. Uh, not a hitbox, but rather a uh, a three D three D mesh, a meshy boy. wondering if we could have like a text component that could say the value of the coin and it can hover like really weirdly like in the bottom corner or something uh, I think it's fine we can we can have all this stuff uh, childed there so that we can if we, if we need to if we need to if we need to scale oh whoops I said if we need to scale we can we can scale everything no modify components there you go we can scale everything together and it's all good it's all good and lovely lovely and good that is a very high quality gold uh, texture I don't think we need anything really that sophisticated for our rubbishy little coins, but whatever, it is what it is. So rundown, we're going to be using the the hitbox, the hitbox hitbox, the collision detect, the sphere collision detection as the overlapper for collection. We do not simulate physics on the hitbox. Uh, we do not have a mass in kilograms. Uh, that should be fine. Uh, coin is going to spin. It's going to spin, 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 spin for the win. Uh, inside this uh, physics sphere that we've got, 
and the, the sphere that we got is just a regular old sphere which deals in the physics collision for the general object. I think I've seen this done before in uh, Unreal test beds. Um, but that's cool. I have my reservations about using uh, an on tick. For that, it's getting yeeted. Maybe that's a little bit, a little bit too high. Horizontal velocity max. Okay. Uh, and in fact. Um, Global post 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 is one from static meshes. Four, four, five. Okay. Uh, ah, level bound blocking volumes. Hey, I just want to make these um, a bit taller. That's, that's all I really wanted to do. So that if we if we play it and uh, the the coin does decide to go wild, it's not going to go so wild that it's going to escape the level. It's going to bounce off one of the walls, and it's going to be accessible. Boop. Is there a, there's a bounciness property, right? Uh, this boy. Other hitbox cash shadow, no. Coin cash shadow, yes. Hitbox, okay. Oh, I didn't see any. I didn't see anything about maintaining an ocean. Oh, the projectiles got. Oh, what do you mean I'm down? Well, I seem to have disconnected from L Twitch. Don't ask me. <laughs> what well, was going to stop anyway? Yeah, cables all connected. You tell me, mate. You tell me. Must be a Twitch issue. Um. Yeah, I've, I have internet access. I have the, the internet. Let's get some unoffensive content. I'm sure I can load the Epic Game Store homepage, right? Yeah. Plenty of internet. So uh, we've got ourselves a, a bouncing, rotating, uh, physics simulating coin. Sorry, the uh, the Twitch folks don't get to see this plenary. I'm sure it's the most interesting thing they've seen all day. 
Um, yeah, so I think we've made uh, significant progress enough to turn the machine off. Uh, I am still recording, and OBS is still trying to connect to Twitch, which is strange. Um, weird. Uh, but yeah, I think this is where we're gonna leave it. Uh, uh, we still got we still got some things to do. We still got sound effects, music, um, a couple of particle effects I want to add. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we'll do those later. Obvious reconnection successful. <laughs> Hello. 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 Twitch seems to contest my reconnection being successful. There we go. Um, hi, everyone. I don't know what happened there. The internet just <laughs> collapsed on itself. Anyway, as I was saying, we've got ourselves a spinning, rotating, boosting coin. Medili. Right there. That's beautiful. Uh, and I'm glad that we've got that going. Uh, moving forwards, I'm going to try and you know see if I can work that on tick thing out. Because I don't think that's going to be very useful. Um, but that is where we're going to leave it today. Can't believe this. People on YouTube are going to hear this twice now. Anyway, uh, moving forward, sounds, music, extra particle effects, all the good stuff that you'd expect a video game to have. Oh, look at the camera. Uh, and anyway, on that note, I will leave you. So thank you very much for tuning into the live video. Tune into the live video. Thank you for watching the video on demands. If you watched the video on demands. And as always, I will see you in the next episode.